Good evening, boys and girls. I have another book to share with you. This one is by my friend Mo Willems. I have met Mr. Willems and he actually taught me how to draw the pigeon that is in these books. Many of you are familiar with Don't Let the Pigeon Drive the Bus or Don't Let the Pigeon Eat a Hot Dog. Well, this is one of his new ones. The pigeon has to go to school. So I thought I would share this one with you today and maybe I'll be able to make another video to show you how to draw the pigeon if you are interested. Okay, so the pigeon has to go to school. Look at our friend the pigeon on the front. What's he saying? Come on. I don't think he wants to go to school, do you? He says, wait, don't read that title. The pigeon has to go to school. Books are so new, I have a hard time opening the page. Too late. Rats. Why do I have to go to school? I already know everything. Go on, ask me a question. Any question. Well, I know almost everything. Does school start in the morning? Because you know what I'm like in the morning. It is not pretty. I wish I was a little chick again. A little itty bitty not going to school baby wavy pigeon. With the baby pigeon picture, that's pretty cute. What if I don't like school? What if I really don't like it? What if I really, really don't like it? What if? <gasps> what if the teacher doesn't like pigeons? And what about the stuff? What about all the stuff? There's so much stuff to learn. What if I learn too much? My head might pop off. I am scared. What will happen at school? What if there is math or numbers? What does the alphabet have? So many letters. Reading can be hard with one big eye. What about lunch? What will the other birds think of me? Will finger paint stick to my feathers? What's up with those heavy backpacks? I'm a fragile bird. The unknown stresses me out, dude. Is there any reason to stress about going to school? No. There should be a place to practice those things with experts to help you and books and classrooms and other birds to work and play with. Maybe a playground. Oh, that is school. Well, how am I supposed to get there anyway? Once he gets right, boys and girls. Step aside, coming through. The pigeon has to go to school. He's very excited. Why is he so excited? What made him change his mind? Think riding that school bus had something to do with it? Maybe? Well, I know I'm excited for school, so I hope you are too.